March 27, 2012, uh, that was actually my birthday, uh, we got called out in uh, Lake Ontario for a, a tugboat, an American tugboat. There was an explosion in the uh, in the basement, like where the uh, engineer was there at the moment, and he got like burned on like pretty much like 85% of his body. So he was in really uh, really bad shape. I am uh, Mass Corporal Steve Delash. I'm presently uh, working with the 435 uh, Squadron as a search and rescue technician. It, it was pretty angry that night. We were uh, with the Griffin helicopter from Trenton, and uh, we were three SARTEC on board. We brought one of the SARTEC that was supposed to be in the Hercules. That was a Coast Guard boat, but they couldn't come closer because the, that was too rough. Because of the weather and because of the, the that was a pretty dark night, we had to uh, being hoist in the water, probably like 75 feet away from the boat, and we had to swim and uh, climb on the side with big tires and. With all our equipment, we uh, actually took care of uh, this uh, person who was like uh, badly burned, and we flew that person to Belleville Hospital. The other SARTEC that stayed behind, that took care of the five until like that was okay to transfer them to the Coast Guard boat, and uh, everybody made it safe uh, back to shore. It can be pretty interesting because you can be called out at 2 a.m. out of your bed go on a mission and six hours later you come back and you go back in the bed and you, you just look at your wife you're like, oh, okay, I just did that. But, uh, I have two young kids and a wife, so it's a pretty big challenge to uh, balance both of, the, both of those worlds. That's actually my biggest challenge. Okay, one thing that is special in our world, search and rescue world, is that we're a pretty like, small group of people. We help each other, like I was going on a mission and like uh, one of our co-workers said, yeah, I'm gonna go pick up the kids and take care of them while you're gonna be away. I have this feeling that it's not me that in, in trouble when I go rescue people. I, I have this feeling that they're the one that needs help and I, you know, that's the job I do.